Okay, guys, welcome back to Scrap Mechanic. Um, so we've made a few modifications. I've done a lot of grinding and a little experimentation. Um, just a lot. Because the game got real grindy for a while. Real grindy. We put together this guy. Got a lot of input. We did manage to figure out that I can link the output to the input. And now, when something gets made and put into this box... It counts for the input. We got some water, because we're making a lot of metal and a lot of glass. Oh, that stuff is pretty cool. We got the level 5, so we can make stuff uh, forever, if I want, which is cool. Um, we got a couple uh, thingamadoos up here that we found these as loot, which is cool, so I just kind of dropped them on the wall till I need them. And we got potatoes, because we have a spud gun. And then our seeds. So many seeds. I mean, no. I know you can use these ones for fertilizer. But for some, somehow I got really low on beets. I think it's probably because I used twice the carrots as anything else. And then tomatoes I was using for pizza burgers when I was making a few of those for giggles. And I accidentally made a baguette, which has tons of cheese on it. It's insanity. And we are also looking... Pretty stylish. That's terrible. Can't see anything. Here we are. I know it's dark, but... Looking pretty stylish with our gloves and our shirt. Our, our pants. Some things that we've found over the... Over the months. Or the, over the months. Over the gameplay. Alright, so... This thing I had seen... I found a YouTube video. Six, seven. That had a pretty cool... Uh drill setup. I wanted to try it. So we're going to try it. <clears throat> I did a build trying to uh trying to uh what do you call it? defend my garden, and it was just not working. Very much not working. Alright, and then on here. I want to see... Do I really need to come over to? I don't think that I do. I think that's just extra width. It's unnecessary. Yeah. Yeah. It is. I think it's just extra width. So we're going to do that. And then we're going to come up here. And then we're going to come up here. Whoop. Yeah. And are we missing anything? Oh, bugger. There we are. I'll drop that there. Okay. And, uh, hey. My welding tool go. Alright, we're gonna weld this crap together. There we are. And that's connected with the thing I'm gonna do, so is that. Should be about right. This is all all the way connected. Hmm. Oh, son of a bitch. Die, you damn plants. Forgot I put a garden up. That's what I get for... What I get for uh, playing and then... Shutting down for the night before the, the attack. A fair bit of damage. Uh, they were over here for a while. Damn. Lost two plants. Oh well. They're just These are just regular plants, so it's not a huge deal. Never, I still haven't found that chemical plant. Super annoying. 
Okay, all is well with the world again. All right, so let's, we're gonna bring this down. I'm gonna grab you. What? I did that wrong. I'm gonna grab you, weld you to here. I'm gonna put a button here. I'm gonna connect you to you and seems to work just fine. So yeah, so we don't need Okay. So we don't need it. Click. 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 Oh, bollocks. I made him too close to the thing I'm gonna do. Okay. Well, that's fine. Um all right, let's get these on the ship. Pull that off. Pull that off. Oh, bugger. It's all right. Let's do this. Bring it over. Uh-huh. Pull that off. And weld it on. Well, let's make sure it's the same length. All right. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so we're good. So let's put this one. They're an, e they're an odd number, so they're gonna be a little off kilter. And now let's see if I can modify um, without damaging two. No, not that one. Can I pull these and it still be okay? Still connected. Okay, awesome sauce. Awesome. So let's do that. Okay. Wait. What? That one was really big. Oh, that one's going to get all buggered. Okay, so this one was designed a little differently. Need to, need to repair this. Okay, so we just need to do that, I think, and weld those together. The end back on, back on it. Put switch on it, connect it, and click. Okay, we're missing a thing somewhere. Okay, we got them on. So now, oh, whoops. I gotta connect the switch to the driver's seat. There we go. So now, when we're driving, let's just look from the inside. It's a little obstructing, but that's alright. Um, my doors. I do have plans to put weight on the back, but hmm. turns a little slow. I could use some more turning ability. But anyway, um, I need to move this, the headlights too, but that's all right. So now when it's time to drill, we just hit three. This comes down. Oh, I also need to hook those to the drilling engine. So many buttons. You know... I probably have an unnecessary switch. Now that I think about it. I think this switch is unnecessary because I have the drill switch. Because those are never going to be lowered without being on. So let me fix that. Okay, I did have to upgrade that engine, so now... That's kind of... It's kind of jumpy. We'll have to try it out. I may need to switch to sports suspension instead of off-road, but off-road's what I had on, on tap. Alright, we gotta go repel this invasion. And go pick my plants.
Here, taters. Ooh, I need to grow taters. <laughs> Starting to get a little low. I had like 400 potatoes. I've just been going ham with these things. All right, I'm going to go pick this stuff and come back for the horde. I made this little tower. It's not much, but it puts me up a little higher, and I'm able to hit just about anything that comes over here. Oh, what's that? I have to go check that out. There's a cow over there. We've got 22 seconds. All right, let's do this thing. Hmm. Doesn't seem like a particularly big one. Let's kick that guy's butt first. Kick that guy's butt. Ooh, they're kind of small. Yep. And the attack is over. <laughs> Somehow there ended up being a piece of wood over here. That's random. Just kind of laying around. Alright, we got you. Alright. Now, the next step is to go test this truck. So I'm going to do that real quick, and then it's time to build a, a, a flying machine. Oh, yeah. Flying machine time, baby. Okay, this one's a little, a bit of an odd location, but we're going to try it out. Do I need to put more power in the engine? All right, let's see how these things do. Okay, they're just kind of exploding everywhere, but front tires are staying down pretty good. Okay. Oh yeah. This is tearing this place up. Look at this. This is crazy. And then we got those. Now we got all this junk on the ground. Alright. I can dig it. Ooh, and it gets those ones that are on the ground. See, those have been a big deal. The ones that are real close, because my previous setups didn't have a way to hit those. I'm having a hard time maneuvering this thing. There we go. Hmm, that's interesting. I think it's just indicative of the weird setup that we have right here. But this definitely cuts it up way better than the other setup. Resource gathering is going to be a lot easier now. A lot easier. Cool. I'd call this a successful test. Alright, I'm going to finish clearing this out, and then it's airship building time. Okay, so we're back. Um... We ended up pulling 220 metal, 114, no, 370 cement from that. Relatively short order. Alright, so, I have decided to use armored glass, because the friction is 3, the weight is 3. Durability is only 4, but um, I'm flying, so I don't plan on getting attacked. The regular metal block number two's friction is only one higher, but the weight is two higher. Right, so that's that's a problem. We don't want to deal with that. So, and then we have these engines, which are most of the weight that we're going to have. We've got this driver saddle three that I picked up from, um, some damn where. One of the one of the weird buildings I went into. We have a switch. We have ba Ooh, we're going to need more bearings. Maybe. I don't know. I've never built a, a flying ship in this game before, so we're going to see what happens. Alright, so let's build it. I have no idea. How big is... Let's see. We don't need the welding tool right now. How big is the seat? It is... Uh, it's one and a half, which is... Weirdly annoying. What? One and a half? Hold on. Hold the phone. One and a half. 
It's a driver's seat. I have a driver's saddle in this. Is it weird like this? This one? Huh? I mean, it looks fine. Let's see what it looks like when I lay it down. And then and put a block here. Oh, it's not one and a half. These X's are too wide. Okay, okay, I see what happened. All right. I'm just being a dumb. It's three. Okay. Uh-huh. Yep, being a dumb. All right, so here's what I want. I want one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. <laughs> Two. How big are these? That's not bad. Then I want one there. And then I want... One, two. Oh, that thing's in the way. Yoink! Okay, and then I want... Boom. You boo me. Oh. Hmm. Take those off. My first master plan was is a failure, but that's okay. We'll press on with and layout, and we'll just see how it works. I have two more. I don't know if I'm going to need them or want them, but I have two more engines here. I wanted a VTOL capability. And honestly, I have no idea how much thrust these things generate. I might not need more than... The two the front. I have no idea. Uh, hmm. If I wanted them on the bottom for vertical takeoff and landing. These are huge. Look how big it is. Can I... can I even? I'd want it in the middle here. The only way to do that is to... that thing. I don't even know if it's necessary. There we go, let's just do this. Let's make it a little bit longer. We'll have one there. See how that works. And then we're gonna put... landing struts down. This thing is a huge drag. Okay. And then... We're gonna need room back here for the... For the fuel and whatnot anyway. Whoa, 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 there, buddy. Let's see. And we're gonna go here. And... Here. How do I want to do this? I could just do the feet. The other thing I was thinking about doing is um, these aren't in the same place. The other thing I was thinking of doing is wheels. That would be kind of cool. Silly glass blocks. Don't need them on that side. One, two, three. Let's see. I don't know. I may completely change this when I figure out. You know what? This will probably screw with the aerodynamics. If that is even a thing in this game. Okay. And then. Oh, damn it. Yeah, 
Does this game even have aerodynamics? I have no idea. Uh, right here. That one. And then... <laughs> Ugly ass ship. Alright, and then let's put... Oh, I didn't grab a fuel tank. Oop. Getting thirsty and hungry. All right, let's grab a fuel tank. And yeah, maybe not. Hmm. I don't know if I want all that fuel. Let's just do a little bit of fuel. We'll roll with this. Yep. Fuel tank will go here. A little off kilter. Can I rotate it? There we go. That's a little more on kilter. A little more kilter. We're gonna need another line up back here. Block blocks. And then we can put where is Senior Engine? Oh, why do I have gas here? It's kind of weird. And then we can go Boomy. Oh, come on. Yeah, this... I All because of that lower thruster. Okay, so now if we connect you to you. You to you. Uh, what? They take fuel, but they don't hook to a fuel tank? Oh, yeah, they do. Wait a minute. But they don't hook to an engine? Why don't they hook to an engine? Don't they gotta be hooked to a switch? I know that much. Helps if I hook the switch to the driver's seat. Um, I just realized I don't. None of the standard controls are working. What? Free camera, follow camera, strict follow camera. Huh, that's cool. Okay. I need to look up how to pilot this thing, because jump certainly doesn't. Okay, that design was rubbish, so we're switching it up. Alright, we're going to do this number here. What's happening? Well, that was odd, to say the least. Alright, we're going to do this. And we're going to try putting, since there's no heat, I don't have to worry about it getting too hot. We're going to try putting the thrusters a little closer to home. Uh, no? Do I need to do this nonsense? There we are. Okay. So, let's do this.
Hmm. I'm not sure what's going on. You would think six engines would be enough to lift something like this. Huh. Okay, I went with a little bit different look. Um, I put a couple boxes on because the whole point of this was to transport for me. Um, I upgraded the engines, threw a couple of fuel tanks on, except it doesn't seem to work quite right. <laughs> For some reason the back is heavier than the front. Not sure why. Hmm. Let's try that. Okay, so that... Hmm. Not sure what's happening. What's different? Maybe... Maybe because... These engines need to be back a little bit more. I bet you that's what it is. Let's try this. That looks a little more symmetrical. Maybe. It's entirely possible. I'm just totally full of crap. Alright, uh... Let's do this, and we'll do that, and that, and we'll do that. Right now I'm just trying to achieve thrust without flipping it. Once that's done, oh, actually, what are these at? Four? Once that's done, I'll worry about yaw and all that. Okay. Hmm, so the front's still a little more powerful. Something... Oh, it's the damn fuel tanks. The fuel tanks are a little bit to the back. I'm gonna need to go get gas, too. Go get oil. A little more. And then we'll up the engine power one. To give us some actual thrust. Okay. Oh, well, let's up the engine power by one. It's kind of amazing. You gotta have level five. This took so many components. All right. Whoop whoop. We're tipping back a little bit still. Alright, so let's put one here. See what that does. Are we tipping to the left? A little bit. Oh, wait a minute. Huh. That'll do it. Holy shit. Oh, no. I just broke the engine off. <laughs> Oh, God. I just broke the engine off. Okay. That was ridiculous. Alright, let's pick it back up. Put the engine back on. How do we have it like that? Yeah. And then... Get down. Put it on engine level five. Whoops. Five. Bring it down. I am not an engineer, if no one has guessed that yet. Okay. Oh, that was already connected. Let me. And then connect you to that. Okay. Oh, it's on the lift. That's better. Now we're still a little heavy. Kicking back just a little bit. That's crazy. I mean, I know there's still a few things I need to add to it. Okay, so we've got lift. I think, I think we're satisfactorily lifting off the ground now. 
because I'm going to have to tweak the weight a little bit because I need to figure out how to control the thrust a little better. Because this is just on. And look how hot, like, I mean, it just goes. Uh, <laughs> I can't, I can't control the spin or the crap. Oh, crap. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ow. So, yeah. That's totally a thing that I have to figure out. Where am I? Oh, there we go. That's totally a thing I gotta figure out. So. But I think that might be... <laughs> might have to cut this episode off here. A lot has happened. We've gone a long way. Um, it's going to take a lot more test flights, I think. Can I... Yeah, there's no... I have no ability for pitch or yaw. Like, at all. The steering wheel does nothing. But at least I have lift. And now I I need pitch and yaw. And if I... I don't need thrusters on the back because if I tip forward, it will push me forward. So I made two extra thrusters that I'm not going to need. But at least I didn't upgrade those two. They're still at level one. Um, now I saw some videos of some dudes using logic gates to control power. So that might be a thing that we do. Like on turns on the turns on the controller. And then the controller somehow uses a logic gate to um adjust power and that I got to figure how figure out how that works. But I've got some fuel being made in here. Okay, yeah, I've got plenty of gas now, but that totally taps me out of oil, so I'll have to swing by my oil pool and pick that up before too long but okay I think so far so far it's pretty successful um oh yeah look at that how is that one so much lower in fuel do I have these not set the same Let's see that's third from the top third from the top third from the top now they're all set the same they're all level five Hmm, I'm not sure. Maybe when I was turning, it did something. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see. It's definitely not as smooth as I thought it would be. I don't think this game is really designed for flight. I think it's more designed for vehicles. The flight mechanic is cool. And I wonder if... I don't know. Yeah, this thing took a little damage. Very strange. I uh, I was driving around and all of a sudden I went to jump out and I, I popped into this. This little this little hole. I have no idea how that happened. I was stuck back here. I couldn't get out. Super annoying. Not super happy about that but we'll figure that out later. But anyway, guys, I think we're going to go ahead and cut the episode off here. Um, please do some like and subscribe. I will drink some moo milk, and uh, as always, have a great rest of your day.